So let's come out to this very, very large park. Protected by this old tree, the F2 and the Pro Pointer. First find of the day it is a copper penny. There's kind of a dime zinc signal in here somewhere, so we'll see what that is. Probably a copper penny. Found another one just a few feet away here. Uh, same year, 1971. Got another dime signal, same area. That's how these coins have been ringing up, so let's see if it's another one. Oh. Yep, it's another. 1967. Here's a wee little one. Oh, this is turning into a good day. I think I may have found what you call a large cent. It says uh, one penny, 1928. On the back, well, I suppose that's the front. You got, you know, some Latin and a head. So uh, I'm gonna, once I get home, I'm gonna go do my research on that one and figure out what that is. But damn. 1928. I think that's officially the oldest coin I've ever found. So, uh, here's the uh, first good high tone in a while. Since this spot's been good to me so far, uh, let's see what it is. Ah, uh, really? One I get on camera and it's another copper penny. A half penny! I don't know the year on it. I'm gonna properly clean it off when I get home. Good quarter tone. Let's see what it is. Another one of them foreign coins, 1963. Another large cent, or a uh, large cent. It's a big penny. Uh, this one's 1938. Quarter tone, let's see.
there's something different. It's a quarter. So, good day for the old coins. Uh, turns out these are actually all Irish and British. So these are uh, 1941 to 1971. I haven't counted them up yet or anything, uh, except the British uh, two and a half whole pennies. And uh, let's see those. 1928 to 1938. So still old coins. I always like finding those. It was interesting finding them out in the middle of an American park. Probably an interesting story as to why they were there. And uh, then, as per usual, I've got uh, lots of copper pennies, a couple of dimes, and a quarter. So, good day for coins. I enjoyed myself. Hope you enjoyed watching. And that's all for today.